Woohoo! And welcome back to Ashtag TCG. I'm Misty and I'm here with your host, Ash, and we have something crazy on our table. Tell us all about it, Ash. Yes, for who indeed. Absolutely excited for this one. It's only been like a year of anticipation. I remember this set being advertised like back during Vivid Voltage. Like, it, yeah, a very long time ago how they were mentioning the 25th anniversary set would be coming out and we had like five sets in between that. So here we finally are. Celebrations. Celebrations. All right. And a celebration it is indeed. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so what are these little tins? What's with these tins here? All right, well, I'll just tell you guys straight up that all of our product hasn't arrived yet. This is all we got so far. Um, we're not even sure how much we're gonna be doing because, well, it's kind of a small set, so we're not gonna be doing like 250 packs like usual. Um, but we intend to probably get a little bit more for sure. Um, and more is on the way, so no doubt about it. Um, anyways, yeah, these little tins uh, basically create a picture. I think it's going to be this exact picture that you see on the box here. Um, pretty excited. I love this artwork that they've done up here. It looks wonderful, honestly. And Do you want to just show off the tins? Full cool little 360 of the whole cardboard. So what do we got going on here? Yeah, if you could call this a booster box, this is like... The most beautiful art on a booster box I've ever seen. Oh, so we've got some more going on here too. Let's yeah, I don't even know if you ever fit them all on there. It's gonna take some time to put it together too, because we're. Oh, I thought there was only four, but there's like, like eight or. Yeah, it's a big picture. Huh. So I don't think we're gonna put it all together for you in this video. Maybe in another video, guys, we'll just put it all together for you real quick. But that should be all of them. We just don't have them in picture format right now because, well, that might take too long. Anyways, we're gonna cut straight to it. All right, um, so how many uh, tins you wanna open here right, in this So we're room? doing the same old, same old, 12 packs. Um, there should be, I believe, 18 packs per box. And I think it comes with like one extra randomish pack. Now I could be wrong, I can't remember exactly, so. We're just going to stick to 12 celebration packs per video, and then we'll decide what we're doing with the rest by the end of it. All right. So, and then I just wanted to also mention this uh, celebration set because it's got two parts to it. Yeah, it's got uh, a this is, section. This is uh, my spreadsheet on uh, mypokemonchecklist.com for celebrations. So we've got the 25 celebrations at the top here. And there's like hollows and then the full arts and hollows and full arts. And then we've got the what's called the classic collection at the bottom here. And these are replicas of old sets. So like number four out of 102 Charizard would be from the base set. From base set. And so on it goes from different sets. Yeah. And uh, that's what it looks like, the spreadsheet. So if you go to mypokemonchecklist.com, or sorry, .ca, I should say. You can print yourself off a copy. Yeah. Just load it up and print it off. Or and if you need any other set list, we definitely have a lot there. It's still being updated if you're into those older sets like we are. But um, Yeah, you can just leave a note for me too and I can create a, a checklist yep. for you if it's not already and there. And they're very uh, thoroughly done, honestly. Like we'll, we go to extensive lengths, like we'll you know check eBay or whatever just to make sure that you know there's certain cards that are available within the set. It's going to be all there. All right, let's get yeah. going with these cute tins. All right. Because just to mention, some of those websites, like, I don't know, what's one of them that has a card list? Um, they don't have, the, they have errors. Not every single card will be listed. Um, we'll list every energy, everything. So, this is really cool. I haven't seen inside these. Try not to spoil it too much, just to have as much fun with it as possible. But very sparkly little pog. It's pretty cool. Yes, I call it a pog. I know it's a coin or whatever, but right. I obviously grew up in the 90s, so we know pogs. And this little card is telling us all about... Oh, and it even shows where it fits into the picture. So it's all black and white, and then the card is in color, the, where this card fits into the picture. That's kind of interesting. Yeah. Starting off, our extra pack was a darkness ablaze. 
It'll be really interesting to see how they've done the variety on these different packs. If it's a Darkness Blaze every time, that's going to be not mm -hmm. the funnest thing. Right. But, Darkness of Blaze for me, too. Yeah. And, I mean, I guess I'll mention it. Um, we're not really interested in opening Darkness of Blaze, so this pack is staying sealed. We're not going to open this one. If we get, like, a Vivid Voltage or Chilling Rain, we'll open, it. we'll open it. But <laughs> we're not opening Darkness of Blaze, sorry. And we're, you're going to hear a bunch of crinkling because we're going to be very careful. Well, I'm going to get this scissors. You, I'm just going to make mine not ripped. I'm yeah. going to be very careful and not rip mine because... I want to keep this package. It's a nice package. There we go. We got the, the top rip. Like how hard could it be? This feels like there's nothing even in this pack. All right. But <laughs> if they're so light because they're only like three or four cards. All right. So I'm keeping my pack all together. I'm not cutting the top off of it. Should I go now that I'm ready? Yeah. You're all good. Um. Okay. All right, here's my card. first card. I'm gonna just show that up nice and close first. Dialga. Is everything holographic? Holy smokes. Uh, the Dialga Try number. Try to get it like, so it shines. Here, you hold it. Number 20 is a hollow. It's either yeah. hollow or full art. There's no non hollow cards or reverse hollows. Really? In Even the that set. Cosmog is hollow? Yeah. I'll see of... about that. Yeah. It doesn't look hollow to me. It is. Oh, it is. Wow. <laughs> so oh, here we go. I just noticed too. I didn't really notice this before. I really like how the 25th sign is actually hollow. So the eyes on the 25 on Pikachu's eyes there are shiny. Yeah, which is a nice addition compared to like the McDonald's set. They weren't hollow. Oh, okay. They weren't yeah. shiny, you mean? Cause like on the on the mark of the Pikachu. Yeah. yeah. So then I have Zekrom. Cool. He's also hollow. So we're just going to lay these out because I'm not putting sleeves on them right this second. Yeah, I've got two new cards. There we go. And Cosmog is also hollow. And Lunala, Lunala is also hollow. It's interesting how all four of those cards were star cards, aka rare cards. Hmm. So you can't really be like, and the rare is... <laughs> All right, Ash. Okay. Yo. Already getting flooded with Cosmogs. <laughs> I feel like all the cards in this set were pretty cool, except for, I mean, I'm not too into the Cosmogs, but oh well. Right. Okay, so. Xerneas, that's pretty cool. I'm kind of excited about this. I like Prime cards. Um, you guys have probably seen in some of our other videos, we have actually this exact prime card we just got not too long ago except for our um, original does not have the 25th yeah, it's actually really cool stamp on it. it's different than the old prime cards because it's actually textured everywhere so mm. and he doesn't oh he has the little shiny ting on his tusk like the yeah. other one yeah and you know it's a prime card when it's got like the little uh things coming off the border there right little shine sparkles off the border um it's kind of like if the card is breaking out kind of look Rip or ripped open yeah that's interesting yeah. so that is from the classic collection here you go so that particular card is from the classic collection and what kind of bell should he get uh, um sleigh bells sure he's special so he gets yeah. sleigh bells <laughs> and I guess just to clarify this is a reprint out of from the looks of it heart gold and soul silver so it's kind of cool Yes, very nice. And we also got a Lunala as the last card again, so doubles will be happening Oops. right away. Maybe. I feel weird stacking these cards on top of each other. I guess we'll penny sleeve everything because they're all hollows. Yeah, and then we are, we need to decide which ones we're keeping, so I, I don't yeah. really want to put them in the sleeve and then pull them out again. Hmm. So this is Palkia. Cool. Everybody ready for that... Uh, Another Diamond. Dialga, so I'll just put the nice. doubles off to the side. Shout out to Diamond and Pearl right there. And cool. here we have a Rockets Zapto. So again, this is from the Classic Collection. Nice. I think we, I hit that with a sleigh bell too. All right. And I'll let you put a sleeve on them. I really like how these uh, basic hollows, they were just a basic hollow originally, and now it's textured. So yeah. that is a nice little addition. <gasps> and 
Island. Wow. You. That is gorgeous. Very nice. Number 11 out of 25. I haven't even been marking these on my spreadsheet. I'm just too excited. <laughs> All right. So while I start marking the spreadsheet, um, Ash is going to open up yeah. his... Hit that with another sleigh bells. Oh, you got two sleigh bells. Yeah. <laughs> We'll put our, our sleigh bells yeah, all along the bottom bells. here. Yes, he's in a read. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we got Rocket Zapdos, check. And we've got Dawn Fan, check. And then we've got Cosmog, of course. And Zeklon. Go ahead, Ash. All right, all right, here we go. Um, pretty cool Groudon. Everybody likes Groudon. Such a cool card. Yes, very nice. Yeah. I agree. And I've got this Reshiram here with a printing line going through him. Oh, no, no, no. So, oh well. Um, kind of hard to point it out, but it's in the lower region right there. Yeah, it's not picking up on the camera very well. Yeah, you, you just... Oh, there, there it is. Yeah. Got it. Dang. All right, so we got... Wow. Double printing line on this guy. Hey. A Kyogre to match our Groudon. Huge printing lines on this guy. It's so easy to see, honestly. Um, yeah, I see them. I don't even know... I don't want to right fight with it. Right by his eye, too. if you look. And then one's like right there going all the way across. You can see it sort of. And then there's another one going like right across like that. Anyway, it's not picking up super wonderfully on the camera, but oh well. Yeah, I like Gen 3 a lot. So Kyogre, Groudon, always welcome to the group. But we're going to need a new Kyogre. We hopefully, don't, we yeah, don't like printing lines. Well, hopefully we get another one. All right, so my friend pulled like 11 of this card, so I just am not excited. Oh, really? Because <laughs> I know that you're going to get one of these like in every pack. Aww. But <laughs> He's a nice card, though. Yeah. Very cute. But he's going to be the reason why you can't pull anything else. Huh. So. All right, well, and he is um, number five. Yeah, number five. All right, so we're opening the next ten. Those four packs. All of these are the exact same, but they are beautiful. I'm gonna open mine. And they come with a little picture card thing too. We didn't really point that out in the beginning, but I, I did on mine. Oh, you did. Okay. And, and the nice thing on the back, if you see the black and white picture, oh, you'll it see says it's, exactly where it's gonna go. Yeah, it, it's colored into the picture, so you know where it fits in. Perfect. All right, let's hope for something else than Darkness of Blaze. That's what I want to see. I can't get mine out. Yeah, I tried to do that too. And I'm like, oh, okay. A darkness of Blaze. Yeah. It is. <laughs> and the reason they do Darkness of Blaze is because there was no good cards in this set. <laughs> <laughs> and there's there my, was, my tin looks like that. Charizard worth like a very little amount. <laughs> Okay, so I got my pack nicely. Oh, oh it ripped. Dang. I tried so hard. So right. what we obviously want to see is, well, I want to see that card too. That's nice. But what we really want to see is the Venusaur Blastoise Charizard. Charizard. <laughs> and Lugia. Yeah, love. I mean, everybody loves Lugia, but still. It's always a welcome addition to any set. Put a Lugia in there. We're good to go. And here's our... Uh, Ooh, that's a reprint collection. from the original um, Team Magma and... Neo Destiny. Isn't that Neo Destiny? No. <laughs> uh, that's, yeah, it's Team Magma and Team Aqua. Oh, you can okay. tell by the little sign right there. But oh, yeah. there. I was looking at the bottom. That, yeah. that I like this reprint of it. I mean... They all do this, but it's got the texturing on it. it. It definitely does it some justice, even though the big Pikachu stamp covers up a majority of the picture, but it's okay. Sorry. That is my complaint about the set. I don't necessarily to... feel like the, the stamp was necessary, but... Are you going to put him in a sleeve? Yeah. And give him a sleigh bell? 
Yes. And then we're on to Lunella again. I like how, as far as I could tell, yeah, you didn't have a printing line in them, so that's good. All right. So I'm just so far behind on my checking, on my checklist. It's really sad. Yeah, we're not even dinging all the cards anymore. <laughs> no, because they're all new cards, yeah. obviously. So how much can we really do dings over and over and over? <laughs> but these sleigh bells are the ones that we're really excited about, so... Okay. He can just go there the at the bottom. Like a little white nope, dot not on, on top there. of Pikachu. Oops. Nobody can go on top of Pikachu. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, another Pikachu. <laughs> can guarantee it. <laughs> okay, go ahead with your pack there, Ash. All right. Well, Zekrom to start things off. All right. Do I hand it to you like usual? Or? Yeah, I'll okay. put him off to the side because he's a duplicate. All right. This is a pretty good card. Okay, the Reshiram is going to replace the other one. Hopefully this one does not have any um, printing lines in it. We'll take this one off the table. We'll put the new one on. So we got to show Dark Gyarados from the original Team Ooh, Rocket set. Oh, yeah. All textured now. He looks way better than he originally did. I was never actually the biggest fan of the artwork on this card. I like it a lot more with the texturing. All right, Sleigh Bells it is. I guess the, to justify the reason I wasn't a huge fan of it is because, like, around that era, there was cooler Gyaradoses, like Shining Gyarados or the Base Set Gyarados. That one just kind of seemed like the worst of the bunch. Um, but we got a new card here. I was oh. mentioning to my friends, I really like this Zacian because his teeth are out. He just looks really aggressive. Like, yeah, kind of vicious looking, honestly. <laughs> yeah, he's cool. Yeah. All right, I'll let you... Give him a bell in the sleeve, and I'm going to open my next pack. Just sleigh belling everything. <laughs> everything is just that good. Yeah. Well, it's like on that level of satisfied, but it's not amazing. Aww. <laughs> I'll be honest here. You guys will see when we're, when we're, when we're ready for amazed, amazing. you'll get something different. Okay. Here we are, Reshiram again, so we're going to have to compare. And... Groudon again. Oh, is this, please tell me that's the Professor Oak. And this one is okay. Exernius again. I want that full art Professor Oak, but this and one's this still cool. this is Professor's Research. Wow, All his right. hand is coming straight out of the card like that. I mean, out of the picture. Like, mm -hmm. that's not really normal for a, like a basic looking hollow. Kind of bizarre. It's pretty cool. I like it. Yeah. I didn't even notice that. that nice card. Not too shabby. Number 23. Okay. Uh, doubles, you're going over there? Yeah. Yeah, okay. This is not a double. Uh, okay. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> I want to give Professor's Research a sleeve for some reason. I don't know why. Mm. I want to put him in a oh. sleeve. <laughs> put, uh, like, uh, why wouldn't you? <laughs> We haven't been doing it. <laughs> uh, yeah, like Lydia didn't get one, so it yeah. says a lot. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. We're like not not in our usual form. Yeah. We're not following the same pattern. It's late. We couldn't wait. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, kind of cool. I'll follow up our Lugia here. We got a little ho -oh. All right. Not too shabby. It's funny because it follows up with Lugia like He's right He's number after. one, by the way. They give us a ho and then a Lugia. Oh, nice. All right. Second Lugia. Another Zekron. That's a lot of Zekron. And another Mew. And another Mew. He's, right. yeah. he's a cute Mew, though. He is. I like the art. I'll give him that. And he's number 11. And I'll mark him down this time. Didn't so we are eight time. in. So we're going to do one more tin. Hopefully we can pull something crazy for you guys. All right. This is my tin. All the cutesies. At this point, I'd be amazed if there was something else than a darkness ablaze. <laughs> um, it seems like that's all there is. This is uh, my card. My pack. And it's darkness ablaze. So yeah, you're 
Is that guaranteed only darkness or blaze? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I think we've settled in. It's really anticlimactic because I was looking forward to doing like a chilling rain pack or a vivid voltage or something like so that. My, oh, my pack is opening up pretty good this time. Didn't rip it. And I have a Yveltal. Very nice hollow card. Number 19. And another Dialga. Another Zekrom. And right, our this first one. is Flying Pikachu V. Woohoo! Not bad. Now that's a nice card, I must say. He needs a bell. He is awesome. Just a sleigh bell? Oh my goodness. For sure. Flying the Pikachu. Dark Gyarados is five times better than that. Okay, if you say and he so. he got a sleigh bell. <laughs> <laughs> if you say so, but I don't know. I'm kind of partial to that Flying Pikachu. He should have got yeah. something better than... Well, I mean, I like the sleigh bells, but still. All right. I'm Nine waiting for you to seven. Oh, take okay. the card. Zikram, here Again. we go. Um, I think we needed this Groudon because ours was printing lined, if really? I remember. I think so. Okay, well, I'll just take this one off the table then and put this right. one on. Another ho -oh. Hey. Alright. And another pr professor's research. Jeez, those rare cards really are rare. Oh. I have another pack that I haven't opened yet. So let's see if I can get that package open this time without ripping it. Oh, no, it ripped. But it's like Champion's Pack, you know? There was like only 70 cards. Lugia. But there was two Charizards. Yveltal. And I think we did 250 packs. Rishiram. No Charizards. And... That one's pretty cool. That one's, that one's not bad. Surfing Pikachu V Max? Are you kidding? That's like awesome. Yeah. He needs a bell. Give him some. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know. It's barely better than. I don't know. It's like sleep bells. Almost like. All right, all right. We'll be nice and we'll give him the cowbell. No. <laughs> <laughs> Not Pikachu. He can't have a cowbell, even though he's his biggest one. There we go. That's what he deserves. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Your fans are going to complain, I think. Well, I'm not satisfied. <laughs> I'll put it that way. <laughs> You're not going to be happy until you get the Charizard, I know, but still. Amen. Pikachu's Give pretty me awesome. Give Venusaur, and I'll be like, sweet. Okay. And here we are. Right, I'm Brian, again. Or new. And our Lugia again. But no, and they won't give us. And on again. So for, he's going to get a sleeve immediately. He's get, Oh, that's a sleeve. Looks I don't know, know. And so he's getting his penny sleeve. Sorry, if you guys haven't realized throughout all of our videos so far, I am not the luckiest guy. <laughs> <laughs> Never start off strong, ever. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, well, that is it for now. It was still a lot of fun. It's really cool to see these cards. They're beautiful. It's just like the values are... We didn't get the top 10 cards here. Right, okay. Yeah. I yeah. agree with you. Yep. Yeah. If we were looking for top 10, it didn't happen. Yeah. All right, well, next video, join us. We'll be opening another uh, six tins in our next video. All right, it's going down. It's going down. All Have right. a good night, everyone. <laughs> Bye.